Assalamu alaikum guys, what's going on? Hope everyone's alright, hope everyone's all good. Enjoying your day. So today I am at a famous market which is called Chris Street Market. Okay? So Chris Street Market is located in the heart of Poplar. Okay, Poplar East London, near Canary Wolf. Okay. Chris Street Market is the home of iconic Chris Street Market. Britain's first purpose-built shopping area for pedestrians all right so this is Britain's first purpose-built pedestrian shopping area all right so I'm gonna quickly take you for a quick tour and show you the market this is one of my local markets so yeah here goes I want to keep on walking around this side first so they've got more material stuff here scarves lady stuff and they've got uh, all these uh, band hair bands needles pins they got this stuff guys this is henna, so uh, mostly ladies, ladies put them on. Then they got pots and pans. They got beans, mop heads. Then this store has all kinds of uh, ladies' accessories, jewelry. So guys, there's a lot of people here once sec. We've got watches. Rolexes, no? No Rolexes. Then they have another shop with glass uh, mugs, cups, pots and pans, plates. Nice fun. And they got outside. Hello. Assalamu alaikum. So this they got in this store fruit and veg, watermelon, mangoes. Then they got this specific fruit that comes out every season, every year actually, and it's from Bangladesh. It's called uh, uh, what's it called again? Jackfruit. It's called a jackfruit. So you've got little stinky little things inside. It's got seeds inside. Personally, don't really have it, but uh, English people love this. And you've got mangoes, fresh mangoes. What country is this from? This is from product uh, of a 
Pakistan. So the Pakistani mangoes are the ones that come out every season as well, every year actually, that are very exclusive. We got these ones too. Fruit and veg. <laughs> they got a whole selection of fruit and veg there. Fruit and veg. And more fruit and veg. These guys, I think, having lunch. I think they're having lunch. They're lunch near lunch? Inshallah. So they have to sit here, hard working men sitting on these boxes and having lunch nice let me check the other one There's another fruit and veg store on the other side quickly show you a quick glimpse it's pretty much the same thing as the other one but this one obviously is in another spot. Oh look, they got another one behind this one. All the rubbish. But at the end of the day, they'll clean all of that up. Jeans. They've got mangoes, grapes, and also jackfruit. Guys, these are some shops here. We've got a pet shop, accessories for pets, laundry, got a laundry shop. And you've got a restaurant that was there, but it's closed now. We've got some uh, inner shops here as well. Let me show you. So they've got all of these shops here. That's the restaurant. Let me just show you the restaurant, what they got here, it's called Curry Hut. So they got all of this, they got meat curry, chicken, got chicken tikka, chana, shark. So yeah, there's another store. As you can see, they've got all kinds of stuff here. Full of bags. Wow. Then you got more fruit and veg over there. Got a nice clock tower. As you can see, more stuff over there. They got inner shops, savers, savers are saving a lot of lives. Boots. Look at this artwork though. Nice artwork. 
and then three shop there Iceland and that's about it really they got nothing much over there got more shops on this side too got a meat shop over here Greg's Then they got the captain's table and chips what's going on guys so uh, that pretty much wraps it up so that's a uh, cruise street market for you guys uh, like I said it's based in uh, Poplar and it's a very uh, historical market I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that quick little tour of, uh, of the market and I'll catch you on the next one hope you guys enjoyed it